Hello guys, so this video is going to be about filling in your eyebrows and I already have the one done and I will show you how to do a little bit more to it as well but this is just kind of like a basic everyday way to fill in your eyebrows and the products that I'm going to be using today is the contour um, it's a cream contour and um, mine is in the color ash um, shadow would be even more ideal for this but um, if you have more of a warmer tone hair color, ash is going to be perfect. Other thing you're gonna need is um, an angled brush and then a spoolie. And um, mascara actually makes an angled brush and a spoolie um, combo that they just came out with. And mine is on its way here right now, so I don't have it to use for the video, but this um, basically is what you're going to need. So super simple. The first thing you want to do is just brush through your eyebrows and I just kind of like to brush them um, just in the direction that they grow. And then you're going to take your angled brush and some of the contour shade. Um, and like I said, this is a cream contour. Um, you guys know that if you already have the mascara palette. Um, and the first thing I always do is start off by underlining my brow. So I go and follow the whole edge here. You don't have to be too picky about um, doing hair like strokes. You can almost do just a line all the way under. And this way you can kind of fine tune your shape a little bit and see how um, that sharpens it up. Um, and then once we have that done, then I'm going to do the top edge. So I just always kind of like to start um, right here and then pull it back. Um, you can just dip your brush in as you need more product. And then I'm going to bring this line all the way into that front edge of my brow. And then my eyebrow on this side, the tail needs a little bit of help. It kind of has a sparse area there, which is no biggie. You just take that angled brush and start doing the little hair-like strokes to fill it in. And the reason I like to use the cream contour and not just an eyeshadow is with it being cream, you can really get um, a more natural hair-like stroke appearance. Um, and so I feel like you have a lot more control with it. So then you're gonna go in and just kind of start doing little flick motions like this and fill in any sparse areas that you may have and like I said, I like to follow the direction of the hair. So um, in the inner part here, your hair kind of grows upward. So we're going to do some flicking motions here, flicking it straight up. And there you have the finished eyebrow filled in. And so that is just with the contour. Isn't that awesome? It seriously um, eliminates having to buy another product for your eyebrows. Um, and then the one thing to remember is everybody always says your eyebrows are sisters, not twins. So um, nobody really has the perfect matched eyebrows. If you want to take it one step further, you can also go in with an eyeshadow and you want to take a matte one. I am going to be using cocoa um, because I do like my eyebrows to be a little bit darker. So I dipped my angled brush into cocoa and I'm going to do kind of the same thing. And what this is going to do is just kind of set it with that powder. And you can also use this to kind of fine tune the shade as well. You do not need a lot of powder, just a little bit and just kind of run it over your eyebrow. And once I have that done, I just go in with my spoolie and kind of brush my hairs into place. So there you have it, a really quick way to do your eyebrows with product that you already have. 